we're going to explain how to copy your Valorant settings to another account. This is handy if you've painstakingly tweaked your settings on one account and want to replicate that perfect setup on a new one, maybe a Smurf account or one on a different computer. Unfortunately, there's no direct copy settings button in Valorant. You'll have to do it manually, but it's not as tedious as you might think. Here's a step-by-step -step guide. One, access the settings menu. First, log into the Valorant account with the settings you want to copy. Open the game and navigate to the settings menu. This is usually accessed through a gear icon or a settings button in the main menu. Two, note down keybinds. Start by writing down all your keybinds. This includes your movement keys, W, A, S, D, aiming, shooting, abilities, and any communication keys. Pay close attention to any custom keybinds you've made. Make a list of every key and the action it performs. A simple text document or spreadsheet works perfectly. Three, video settings. Next, take note of all your video settings. This includes your resolution, for example, 1920 x 1080, aspect ratio, refresh rate, graphics quality, low, medium, high, etc. Anti-aliasing settings, shadows, and any other video-related options. Screen brightness and gamma also matter. Again, write this down meticulously. Four, audio settings. Now focus on your audio settings. This covers your master volume, music volume, effects volume, voice chat volume, and whether you're using any audio enhancements. Note any specific settings you've adjusted to improve your in-game experience. Five, crosshair settings. Your crosshair is crucial. Take a screenshot of your crosshair settings or carefully write down each component. The color, outline thickness, inner lines, outer lines, center dot, and any other customizations. This section requires precision. Six, gameplay settings. Don't forget about gameplay settings. This includes things like your mouse sensitivity, raw input, aiming settings, and any other preferences that affect how the game feels. Write these settings down clearly. Seven, apply settings to new account. Once you've thoroughly documented your settings from the original account, log into your second Valorant account. Now go into the settings menu and carefully enter all the values you just noted. Double check everything to ensure accuracy. This is where your detailed notes are invaluable. Take your time. Eight, test and refine. After copying all your settings, launch a game or practice range to test them. You may need to slightly tweak some settings based on your new system's performance or personal preference. This final step allows you to refine your copied settings for optimal performance. Remember, even seemingly minor adjustments can significantly impact your gameplay.